Casey's Crazy Kitchen. Thank you for joining us in Casey's Crazy Kitchen. We're going to make some pasta with the meat sauce today. First, the prep is key. You get all your shit prepped, ready to go, and then you deal with it. You gotta show us the product and show us what you're gonna do with it. That's how this this part of the, the segment works. Or you wanna, you wanna see my junk? No, that's not what I said. We got garlic, baby. I plan on just smashing it all at once. Somewhere in this range. We don't want them too fine or finer. You want it finer like my vagina? <laughs> we got onion. Here's how you cut an onion. You take this side off, preferably with a sharp knife, and then you take this side off, also preferably with a sharp knife. I'm not that smart, so I like a healthy onion. Remove all the bullshit. However you gotta do that, you got water in your eyes. That, I love. I don't know what that is. <laughs> That's basil. <laughs> That's basil. We have basil. <laughs> we got orange. So I'm feeling for the rind right now. You wanna see how to peel an orange? Cause this ain't the way to do it, pilgrim. <laughs> <laughs> See, no, just set that on the top there with our other ingredients you can just set right there, yeah. Tomato paste, tomato sauce. Uh. Right. Yeah. That's 100% Angus. And look at that, it's meat. We got some of that jumping off. Here it goes. I go with right in the to me, that's medium high. I need to put the sausage in first. Okay. How long we talk? Uh, until they're brown. Until they're brown like me? Is it? The right color, did you yeah. just did you just get a close up on my skin? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Here's what's happening now, folks. I am smashing up brown beef. And what you gotta do is break the ground beef up so that you don't have a big-ass hamburger. This is a good meal, folks. Like, you, you, can, you can feed a family of five or six with this shit. We have the Himalayan salt. Oh, it, is that not the sexiest thing you've ever seen? You don't want too much, though. Fresh cracked pepper up in there. I'm a pepper addict. I don't know about you, I try to make it a little bit uniform, like, you don't have this one big hunk and then a bunch of small hunks. That's how it should look. So we're putting this into a separate pan, and you even leave some stragglers in there, like, it's all flavored. It's all going to the same place. We're going to start with some olive oil. You keep in mind, you don't wash the pan out. You're, you're, we're talking about all that flavor in the pan, folks. Oh, is that keep enough? Going. No, it's a little dress. Uh, keep going. Uh, no, bigger dress. Uh, bigger. Uh, all right. Okay, watch this. Uh, get it in the pan. Uh, that's what she said. Get it in the pan. So we got some onions jumping on. Honestly, if you could translate this smell on camera. Now throw some garlic up in there. Don't tell me what to do. I don't know if we got some garlic lovers, but if you don't want spaghetti sauce, the garlic don't don't, eat it. don't don't cook it this way. That is garlic and onions, and it smells. Like, oh. <laughs> Nate is suggesting that I just I set this in here. I don't mince it up. I don't do no, anything just set to it. In it. Just you're good. Put that in now. Grab yourself a bay leaf. What if it's small? It's good. Perfect. The 
this looks ridiculous people I don't know if you see this but it looks ridiculous it's probably gonna taste like the bomb I'll let you know after the fact but it looks ridiculous come on so go ahead and tell them what you're doing now what are you doing I'm stirring the poo <laughs> I'm sorry right now I'm stirring up the sautéed onions and the garlic we have some orange peel in there and then we have a couple of leaves of what was it basil you, you need to edit that part so we have a couple of leaves of basil also <laughs> I forgot about the bay leaf we also added a bay leaf to this now, okay. now what we should do is we should probably season it. So you're gonna tell the viewers you're gonna season it. I was gonna go smoke a cigarette. Perfect. I mean, me personally, you know me. I put a bunch of fucking pepper in it. I mean, to me, just just the ingredients. It's not your regular spaghetti sauce operation. We're, we're, we're doing this gangster style, yeah. so deal with it, folks. Should I, should I do like this? We are doing that. First, I'm going to pull my pants up, <laughs> and then after that, we're going to put together the sauce that we've created and the meat that we've browned. And you keep in mind, we're, we're talking a $20 meal, but... Maybe things cost more in your area. So, we're just trying to give you some basics of, you know what I mean? You throw some ingredients together and you can make it happen. Uh, and how long are we talking? We're talking 20 minutes at least. But it can go longer, but we're gonna let that So simmer. you're saying I can go smoke a cigarette? Well, what about the pasta and stuff? Okay. I can smoke a cigarette while I'm waiting for the water to boil. Come on, dog, work with me. And <laughs> Casey's crazy kitchen. Do the back from break thing now here. This is where you say that the sauce is simmering and that we're gonna make pasta. Don't, don't tell me what to do. I'm back from my cigarette break. Now we're gonna make the pasta. You keep in mind you can put it on whatever kind of pasta you want. It can be angel hair which cooks quicker. You can put it on the rigatoni number 24, which is gonna take a little bit longer. What do we got going on in here? We don't have anything going on in there. Why not? You gotta boil that water, I right? Done that. And we're gonna put in a very liberal amount. Let's say three pinches of Himalayan salt. What we have here, folks, is that the boiling of water. It helps if you cover it, just to make it heat up quicker. That's how you do that. You just kind of boil water and then that's how you do pasta. We're going 14 straight. You've got your salt in the water. You just want to make sure you stir that pasta up and then let her do its thing. And we're talking fresh basil. You could probably cheat and use some powdered chip. No. And you're talking about some shaved organic parmesan. I mean, nice flaky parmesan. And don't get me wrong. I deal with this all day long. That's not that's not Parmesan cheese. This is Parmesan cheese. For the audience out there, what he just suggested is preposterous, and I can't do it. He wants me to be sexy, and I can't. I did not say that. Yeah, you did. No, I did not you say wanted, that. You want some dance moves. No, I, I wanted you to drain the noodles. I misunderstood him. I thought he wanted dance moves. I don't he see how you missed the coast too moves. for... But, yeah.
I should have worn my oven mitts. Maybe if you do this, you want to wear things that protect your hands from heat because I didn't and my fingertips just burned off. I was wondering how you were doing that. And then what you do is you you put a, your pasta in a bowl. That looks good, huh? Not darn it. I think right there. Yeah. <laughs> we, have to, we have to garnish it. I gotta do shit. Man. Yeah, you gotta garnish it. A little bit of that. Tell them what you're doing, too. You just, you can't just do it. I'm sp Look at this oh. fresh. I thought we already got them. The fresh shaved Parmesan cheese. You gotta say something to audience like, would you look at that? It's perfect. Or something like that. You Don't think. you want to look at that and take a dump? That's not what I told you to say. <laughs> no. <laughs> we've, we've already got what I'm eating. We've already discussed how to prepare it. Right, I'm gonna get some basil on there. I'm gonna blow it off because oh, it's oh. still hot. I want to suggest we kneel. That's what I want to suggest. Whew. Okay, bye. I'm going to eat the rest of this. Casey's Crazy Kitchen. What we want is just to cook a decent meal. We don't want any racism or anything else jumping off in this. So let's just cook the meal. You know what I mean? You tell me to throw the sausage in first because it's fat, like a Negro. I'll throw the sausage in first, but I didn't say that. I'll okay. throw it in. Here. Casey's crazy kitchen.